Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to announce the Bread Boy Diet. And just like the nutrition genius, guys, it's a joke. And, you know, for the past two years, my diet has looked roughly the same. A large portion of starch today, we're having bread. In the past, we've had rice, pasta, potatoes, potato chips. That large portion of starch has been a constant. We have a small amount of red meat and, you know, by conventional wisdom, not a small amount, half a pound to a pound of red meat per day, leaner. And then I'll have like something here and there on the side, whether it's for taste, I like to enjoy it. Most importantly, the water key for present, the probiotic that's allowing me to comfortably eat all of these carbohydrates. Whereas someone with a normally healthy gut microbiome probably wouldn't need as much of a probiotic. Although I will say every single indigenous group had some sort of fermented drink or fermented food. But the point is they consumed bacteria on a daily basis to keep their digestive systems healthy. And we have some masticum powdered up as well. Uh, so I'm not really going to sit down and eat and do all that stuff today. We're just going to kind of do a quick synopsis of why I'm eating certain things and just give you guys an overview. Uh, something that is new is this is an artichoke dip. Uh, so you guys that saw my white bean dip recipe like two weeks ago, I just replaced the white beans with artichokes. Same exact recipe. Um, it's okay. I'm not, you know, it's not that great. Um, if I got artichokes in oil, it probably would have tasted better or made them fresh myself, but it would be a lot of work. It's still pretty enjoyable. I encourage you guys to try it out with artichokes too. Just a nice change of pace. So I have one baguette here. Half of it I slice up to dip in the artichoke dip or as the past two weeks, the white bean dip and roast beef sandwich with beef from Frankie's Free Range Meat. So the purpose of the artichoke dip is added fiber, gut motility, flavor, just really something I enjoy eating. It's kind of, you know, a lot, very well seasoned, a lot of garlic, a lot of onion in there. The bread is the main starch source. And when your liver is detoxing, it needs something to put those toxins into. Starch is the best source for that. Fiber is excellent as well. Sugar is okay too. Bread is an excellent choice. The artichokes are an excellent choice. Those are serving that purpose. Um, Pure carbohydrates, you know, they're getting digested by the bacteria in the water kefir. The only real concern on that end is are we depleting certain B vitamins because it's not a whole grain? And that gets into a little more. But the roast beef, I mean, my channel used to be carnivore. You guys very well know all the B vitamins, cholesterol, protein, amino acids, important nutrients that are in red meat. And I would say out of everything I've done, you know, in my life really, more recently, and diet to be healthy has just been to have that consistent quality animal protein every single day for cellular health. Above anything else, guys, if you're eating half a pound to a pound of quality animal protein per day, beef or game meat, you're going to be really healthy in general. The other stuff can kind of cause issues depending on what you're doing, but that one constant has definitely helped me a lot. The probiotic, this is water kefir. This is the pineapple flavor we have on Frankie's Range Foods, guys. A lot of you familiar with yogurt, dairy, kefir, other probiotics. Those are excellent as well, except I'm not a fan of dairy due to the calcium content. And this is something that I've been able to have consistently with every single meal and feel good on. Sometimes I'll have the water kefir grains too. But this water kefir combined with the masticum are the two answers to people saying, oh, well, I can't eat carbohydrates. I can't do this. I can't do that. If you can't tolerate carbohydrates, the water kefir and the masticum as well as radiation protective clothing will help you. Whether you get it from me, Wi-Fi shielding.com, this is the full coverage, long sleeve t-shirt and long sleeve pants. You're sleeping in a bed canopy. The radiation from our environment will damage your organ systems and digestive system to the point where you're not gonna be able to tolerate normal foods. You know, it's taken me a while to kind of discover all of these nuances and all of these things. And hopefully eventually in a few years, I have um, my second book done and I have more of an infrastructure with my businesses to provide you guys with all the high quality food products. Um, better, even better idea is I'll be on a beach with some Columbia girls. That, that, would, that would be even better. I'd be much happier doing that as much as, uh, <laughs> let's not complain too much today. So uh, 
someone actually emailed me um, with uh, some very pressurized water key for accident, but I, I've said it before, guys, it has to be kept in the fridge for you know, 12, 24 hours before you open it to reduce the, the pressure, the bacteria will deactivate. And then the masticum, um, you guys just grind up in a spice grinder, but uh, everything you eat, you know, if it's fresh, if it's properly prepared, if you're sourcing it well, should be absolutely delicious. You know, I get this organic baguette from a French bakery in the city. We make the roast beef ourselves, very rare. It's delicious, amazing. And the artichoke dip, caramelized onions, caramelized garlic. It's very, very enjoyable. Yeah, maybe a few meals this week I was lazy and hungry and I just had white beans and steak, you know. That, that's what I was doing for a few days this week. But um, when I put in the effort, I enjoy this a lot. I feel good eating this. And, you know, if I can get a lot of sun this year, next year, um, I, I think I should be feeling much, much better. Um, I'm already feeling way better. I haven't been, you know, having to take naps throughout the day. Things have been improving slowly but surely. And I think it's just going to take a little more time because we've been doing this protocol for almost two years now, a year and a half, two years now. And uh, maybe another year and a half, two years will be somewhat back to, to normal because they do say it takes your liver like something like five years to recover, but that's probably five years after you've detoxed it. So we'll see. But thank you guys for joining me today. Hopefully this gives you guys some ideas to what you should be eating. And uh, if you have been carnivore, if you have been keto, maybe after seeing me do these day of eating so many times, it encourages you to get back to uh, somewhat of a normal diet. And hopefully you can improve your health to the point where you can really eat whatever you want and have those restaurant nights or cheat meals or whatever and still feel good. But you guys can go to frank com to support me through all of my businesses. Uh, we have the roast beef on Frankie Strange Meat. We just launched the eggs this week. I think I'll do an egg recipe on Saturday, something a little creative that my mom's been bugging me to make for a while. We have the water key for on Frankie Strange Foods. Uh, we have the Masticum on organ supplements and Wi-Fi shilling.com guys. Uh, we have the clothing and some other stuff available. A lot of exciting stuff, hopefully over the next few months coming in. And some uh, some things for you guys to help you improve your health. So, any questions guys, feel free to leave them down in the comments below. If you want to save on shipping and combine orders, uh, you can do that too. Just reach out to me via email. Thanks again guys. And I'll see you for tomorrow. Any news stories, any ideas for video, let me know guys. Haven't been following the news lately. <laughs>